round of the uh, Cadillac Championship, part 315, Paul Casey had promised his caddy, Craig Conley, that they would split the prize if he hit an ace. Casey delivers. Conley, he thinks they won a Cadillac. <laughs> Because Craig thinks that because it's Matt Aston, he's going to win that Cadillac in the background. It's the other hole, Craig. Uh, so, you, you don't get the car. Oh, he's like, ah. <laughs> no wonder he thought they won an SUV. The vehicle was right there on the tee box. Classic case of false advertising. But you should also get the facts straight before you jump around like a kid on a Skittles binge. Accountants, they get the facts before they do anything. Had everyone in the top ten been more like an accountant, they never would have found themselves on this list. Go accountants! Deep to left, Soriano's gonna watch it go, not off the wall. Nick Mills thinks it's a long run. the 1994 Goodies 250 with the race finishing under caution, Mark Martin believes he's won and drives off the track to victory lane. One problem, there was still a lot to go. David Green took the checkered flag. Martin finished up in 11th. I've been pulling for David Green to win so really hard, but that's not, not like that. That's the stupidest thing ever done. Mark bouncing around. As flashy as Alexander Daig's celebration was, it came a little premature as the goal was called back after it was ruled the puck was knocked down by a high stick. Kelly Malvo was ready with his interception celebration against Milt Stiegel and the Bombers, breaking out the Sharpie until he learned his interception was ruled a touchdown. A touchdown has been scored. Oh, it's not the way they ruled it initially. And Milt Stiegel is saying to Kelly Malvo right now, sign this, baby. In the Moroccan League Cup, penalty kicks were needed to decide a winner. Keeper Khalid Askari celebrates his save by pounding his chest. But while he turns his back, the backspin on the ball takes it across the line for a goal. And Askari's team would be eliminated from the competition. That wasn't even the first time Deshaun Jackson got a little ahead of himself. In the 2005 All-American Bowl, he again missed times his celebration, fumbling before the goal line. Team Sabona takes the lead with a three pointer with only 0.6 seconds left in the clock. But while the team is celebrating, Serbian rival Partizan inbounds the ball and throws up a prayer from 75 feet away. And it banks in, giving Partizan the win. Fourth down and six. Center Top 10 is brought to you by Subway Restaurants. Think fresh, eat fresh. We won't jump the gun on this one. And here it is, the Mitsubishi.